A UW alum on his way to Canton, Ohio to be inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. News 3 now this morning. Lucky enough to talk with the former Badger. Our Shane Hogan is here to share the conversation. Good morning, Shane. Hey, good morning, Leah. That's right. Joe Thomas played here at UW from 2003 to 2006, then went on to play 11 years for the Cleveland Browns. We caught up with Joe ahead of his big induction and talked about how UW played such a vital role in his journey. You're back here on the turf that you played on. What are yeah. some of the memories that come back into your mind? Yeah, a lot of good memories. You look up to this end zone, you yeah. think about all those jump arounds that you watch the students going bananas and think about where my parents used to sit over yeah. there in, in the family section. I think about the game in 2003 when we beat Ohio State as they were coming off their national championship game. Uh, I think about being out here in maybe a little bit more bittersweet moments when it was Barry Alvarez's last home game. We lost to Iowa. But you also remember all the players that you played with, all those friendships, all those memories that you made, not only on the field, but in the weight room, in the classroom occasionally. Your best memories a lot of times in your life that stick out the most are from your college days, like your early 20s. No doubt. Because they were the most emotional. Did you ever think the Hall of Fame was a possibility? <laughs> you know, it wasn't even until the end of my junior year in college that I even dreamed of playing in the NFL. I just enjoyed playing the game so much. Yeah. I enjoyed every part of it, even the parts that suck. It's crazy because I never looked down the line saying, hey, I'm gonna be willing to put myself through this misery now because someday at the end of the rainbow, there's gonna be a pot of gold. Like, I just loved every day. Right. And so it made it easy and I think that helped me just kind of be where my feet were and just enjoy the moment. What does it mean to represent Madison, to represent the school, to represent Badger fans yeah. all over the place when you put that gold jacket on? Yeah, it's really special, but I also feel a little bit of pressure, right? Yeah. Because this is a place that I've loved so much my entire life, right? We love it so much that we want to make sure that when I am in Canton for the enshrinement that I'm properly representing <laughs> Madison and all of Badger Nation because they deserve it. What a special conversation. I'm a, jealous. A special wow. person, you know. I mean, it was just really cool to kind of be on his stomping grounds where he made all these memories uh, as a Badger, really launching his career as a football player. And uh, to be able to reminisce about that, hear about it, where he actually played was you called very him cool. Humble, you yeah. called him such like a down-to-earth guy. He says something in there that really stuck with me because he came off as so charismatic. He said he never, you know, thought about going into the NFL Not until, until he was older. A junior in college, yeah. Because he just loved the yeah. game yeah. so much. I mean, wow. Not thinking ahead, a very present yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I mean, he set some really impressives in the National Football League, uh, really impressive records. And to hear a guy with that kind of stature act like a guy that could be your next door neighbor yeah, exactly uh, they've chosen to make their home in madison and they've got a uh, lovely young family and he's got a bunch of stuff going on the side right now but right now his life everybody <laughs> wants a piece of joe thomas you know, we got it <laughs> and, uh, we appreciate joe for for sharing a little bit of time with us there is a, a full story that uh, includes an interview that leah and i did with joe coming up on news three now at six tonight thanks for sharing that conversation absolutely really special really very a lot of fun